we present a novel approach to perform anti-aliasing in a deferred rendering context. Here is a complex scene rendered with traditional deferred shading, exhibiting severe aliasing artifacts. Supersampling can be used to reduce these artifacts. However, this implies that a large number of samples needs to be shaded. Our approach reduces the number of samples required while maintaining high quality and works as follows. First, we render the scene attributes to a supersampled G-buffer. Second, we shade the first sample for each pixel, giving us a first guess of the final result. Then, we run an evaluation pass, which applies our geometric metric to the enlarged G-buffer, and a shading metric that evaluates the image rendered with a single sample. As a result, we did use a texture containing the required number of samples per pixel. Finally, we compute our image by shading each pixel adaptively, based on its required number of samples. On the left, you see a reference solution that was computed using 16 samples per pixel, with the traditional supersampling approach. On the right side is our adaptive solution. The sample density that is used for the final image for our algorithm is displayed here. The absolute difference to the reference is depictured here. Our metrics ensure that this complex geometric scene with various detailed textures is rendered efficiently at high performance. The first term of our metric is sensitive to geometric discontinuities, whereas the second term reduces texture artifacts and artifacts at shading discontinuities. Here is a scene with specular materials and high-resolution bump and diffuse texture maps. Again, our method outperforms the traditional approach while maintaining high quality. To reduce texture artifacts even further, our approach can be combined with anisotropic filtering, as described in the paper.